Hello, welcome to our daily reflection program, I Got Today. I am Father B.J. Thomas, a divine word missionary. The Gospel of today narrates the incident of Jesus and his disciples traveling in the boat, encountering the storms, and how the Lord brings in calm and serenity in that situation of turmoil. All the three synoptic Gospels, Matthew, Mark, and Luke, not only report this incident of Jesus calming the sea, but also mention a simple yet significant detail. Jesus slept. It's amazing to imagine this situation. The storms are raging high. The waters are probably hitting hard on the boat. The disciples are anxiously rowing, struggling to balance. There is terror all around. There is a sense of fear. There is growing apprehension. Yet, in the midst of all this, the Gospels say that the Lord is sleeping. That really, really must be a good and sound sleep, isn't it? Who would be able to do that? The one who has immense faith and trust in God has absolutely nothing to worry even in the midst of any storm. The one who has great confidence and belief in divine providence has just nothing to fear, even in the midst of any horror or terror. Jesus was in communion with his Father. This bonding made him to be assured of every protection and care. Here is an important spiritual principle that Jesus teaches us. The greater one is in communion with God, the greater and easier is one's trust in divine providence. The higher one is in union with God, the lesser will be the anxiety and worry factor in life. The Lord today invites us to have the same kind of faith and trust in Him and his divine providence. Life will undoubtedly bring with many storms and tempests in life. We may experience lots of fear. We may feel the end is near, but the one who trusts in him is assured of safety and security. The more we are close to the Lord, the deeper would be this faith and confidence. Amen.